Hey guys and welcome back to Seventable Station Alien Isolation. We are in the component storage of Seekson Synthetics storage place. Yeah, the, there was the tongue twister, wasn't it? Seekson, Seekson Synthetic Storage. We are trying to find our way, and in fact I will show you. If we come over this way and we look out this door here, we should be able to see, yeah, this. Now, you see these stacks here. We want to be on the second row of stacks down that way. Unfortunately, there is an electrified, electrified, yeah, electrified floor between us and it. So there's a bit of a trouble there. We've just watched a, a working Joe step forward and destroy himself for our not amusement, but you know, for our uh, gaming such and such. Is this still full of for the thing? It is okay. I've got to do it. I've got to do it. We've got to go and have a look. Uh, there's a lot of stuff. No, it's just a, a blank wall that we cannot walk through. Okay, so it would not let me walk further into there. I had to try. I had to try. Now, what we're going to look for now is a panel that enables us to turn stuff on and off. Now, there is this terminal here. Unfortunately, I don't think we found anything on that terminal to actually allow us to change this air purification stuff. We're going to go back in. We're going to go find out. Uh, I'm going to scroll our way down here. Utility error. You see, we just couldn't do it. Uh, I'm going to medikit again. We are running a bit low on medikit. No, we didn't want to make it. We are running a bit low on medikits, but more importantly, we are running low on stun baton stuff. And I don't, I just don't know how to re recharge my stun baton, uh, which is a little bit annoying because I find the stun baton, uh, well, at least intellectually, I think the stun baton is a lot more useful than the bang 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 gun. I mean, could you imagine if we started, like, firing off a gun in this scenario here with aliens and, and men and androids and everything just out to get us? I, I, uh, I just don't think it's a good idea. Right, we're going to check this terminal again. Just make sure that this terminal, this other terminal, uh, doesn't have the utility. It does not. Okay. Hmm. So a little bit annoying. I don't know what we're going to do about that. Perhaps we'll go have a look out the front somewhere. I just... Nothing on the map. Oh, look, there, there is a vent going in the back. Now, I'm thinking we can go in, up, and this way somehow. Maybe. Maybe. I don't know. I don't know whether we can or can't, but this is the thing that I ha we have to find out, right? This is why we're here. This is why it isn't a horror slash exploration game, yeah? Horrid because you know I am scared the entire time we're doing this an exploration because I ain't got a clue where we're going. Uh, there were a whole load of people here last episode. They're not here anymore because something tried to kill them. And I'm, I'm looking for signs of drool. Do we see signs of drool anywhere? I don't see signs of drool, which is worrying because that means we don't know where stuff is. Oh, look, we've got a. Ah, oh, should we follow this objective marker? Is it a little bit cheaty? A little bit cheaty just to use the objective marker? It's the difference between uh, Morrowind and Oblivion, right? You know, Morrowind you had to figure stuff out. Oblivion you just followed around, like, following this marker. Uh, so we can go this way. It, it's telling us to just carry... No, through here. Okay. Ah, oh, it's just going to be pointed at that far panel with no way of getting actually around it, is it? So it wants us to go this way? No. I can't go that way. You couldn't possibly be telling me to go this way, surely. All right, well, let's have a look. It's currently up. Can we can we do something about popping it down? I don't know. I don't know. If we do this, do we have enough space to fit through? No, we can get a charge pack, though. No. I think this is lying to me. I think it might be lying to me. Uh, can we get through this? It definitely wants me to go down that corner right there, doesn't it? Do you think maybe... Or I think maybe it's actually pointing out that there is a event on the other side of the room. Uh, I, th I, I think I don't know. We're, we're going to go find out. I'm not sure how good the pathfinding on that objective marker is. I mean, so far it has been pretty pretty good. Uh, every time that I've had a couple of doors to pass through or stuff like that. I mean, you saw on the walk up here that it, it sent us all the way around. But that could just be like uh, Google Maps pathfinding, you know? And and that's not great. It just sends you to the nearest available sort of major road and then follows you down that way. Um, as opposed to following all the, the quickest route. Ah, look, look there's, a, there's a vent we can use. That. In fact, I've used that vent already. Uh, let's start crawling. Because there are signs of death here. Like th these, these dead bodies. These were not here earlier. 
Uh, flashlight batteries, blasting caps. We can't take the blasting caps. That's a, that's a real shame. It's a real shame. They were just kind of stood around talking up there, weren't they? Nothing really to worry about. This guy does have an ID tag to pick up, though. I wonder how many ID tags we are missing. Or how many I've picked up with not even looking at. Quite a few. Quite a few. Uh, what we're looking for here, not that vent. Is there another vent? Is there another vent? There does not appear to be another vent. Maybe this is the one we want to go use. Let's let's try that. We'll, we'll crawl over this way. Let's walk. Let's walk. I don't see anything in particular that we need to dodge from. There are no vents in the ceiling. There is no movement going on. Okay. There is a ladder over here, though. Is this the? Is this where we came out of last time? I think it is. Ah, that, that might be going around in a circle. That would be terrible. Yep, that's terrible. Okay, well, there's not much else we can do at this point. <clears throat> Let's pull up the map. Let's have a look. Yeah, it's telling me I need to go that way. Not sure if this bunch of vents does anything or if any of these do anything. Let Let's just carry on walking around and seeing what we can do. Maybe it really wants me to go back down that ladder, doesn't it? I don't know. I'm just going to carry on walking around. Just going to carry on walking around. Uh, check out these terminals. I'm pretty sure I did this bit, though. I'm pretty sure I did this bit. We are looking for a utility that could possibly turn something off. Or, well, just anything, really. Anything that's uh, different from what we've already done. Uh, I don't see stuff. Is that a companion cube? Oh, no, it's a cardboard box. Just a box. Okay, can we have a look out here? Oh, this is an Android, look. Yeah, can't take stuff from me. Okay, this is fine. This is fine. Uh, the next thing we're looking for is this terminal in here. Yeah, there's a safe point here. There's a terminal. This is good. This is good. Can we use this terminal to any effect? Probably not. I'm not expecting great things from this, but we will find out. No. Okay. So, no aliens. No people. Only a little bit of dodgy music in the background. And following a marker that doesn't seem to actually do any good for us. Well, that is gaming, I suppose. Uh, we're supposed to go through this door here, yeah? What about this door? Does this one open at all? No, no it doesn't. There are boxes and stuff around, nothing really that shows me what I'm supposed to be doing. And we are back in here, okay. Well, I suppose this is the thing we've got to do. It... <sighs> So I've not seen any way of turning stuff off. Is there is there a wiring diagram that I have missed? Is there anything I have missed? There's bound to be something that I've missed. There's, there's no way that this is actually a dead end. Um, it still wants me to go over this way. It very much wants me to come over this way. We can't press this button. We can't interact with stuff. We can, can't even pick up that blasting cap. Looking about... I don't, I don't know why it wants me to go specifically here. Or even what... Yeah. I don't know. It just it seems... A little bit dodgy. A little bit dodgy. Almost as if... There is something hidden. Something missing. I, I'm, I'm not sure. So we've checked this up and down. I can't use that panel there. I've got key cards. We can't use that panel. Can't use this. Coming back. Let's try and move... Oh, we can get through this way. Ah, uh, but just because we can get through doesn't mean we can turn stuff off. So no, because the entire floor looks deadly to me. Looks more than deadly. Looks dangerous. No, can't use that. So if we can't use that one, and we can't use this one, why are these movable, but this one isn't? Hmm... And why is this the only way we can't go? Right, well, we're going to have to start venturing out onto that floor and seeing how far we can get without killing ourselves, right? Move down. Move up, move down. Do we get to send it all the way down? Is this the thing? Ah, oh, well, you look at that. It's, oh, okay. Well, every time we clicked on it, there was a different thing to do. So... I just assumed that it would only go up and down, but it looks like we can go down a lot. So let's just carry on doing that. Down, down, and down to the last one. Oh no, one more. Down to the last one. Maybe we should have gone up, all the way up. 
That might have helped. All right, so we're supposed to go through here. And then off over this way. Yeah, okay. Well, that was confusing. That was ultra confusing. But now that we know what we're looking for, we should be able to make our way all the way around. Wow, that, that was a lot, lot more time on that than I had ever thought of spending. Oh, look, there's acid marks on the wall. It's not good, right? It's never great. There's a green flashy thing on the floor there, though. I like green flashy things. So, so according to that working Joe, what we're looking for is down here. We want to move it down. Compression cylinder. Brilliant. Replace the component in the elevator. Maybe, maybe we'll escape this place by the end of the episode. I wouldn't hold your breath, though. I'm not holding my breath. As you can tell by the way that I'm talking. Uh, you know, holding breath and talking. Not the, not the greatest combination of stuff. Okay, I'm expecting to get chased by an alien at any time soon. Uh... Now, now that we are on the move and doing things that look like they might be useful, I should imagine that the game is going to start punishing us for it. Because that's the way this, these sort of games work. No sensors, no way up. Ah, oh, I was kind of hoping it would be an up and over so we could get to the... What was that? I was hoping we could uh, go up and over and get to the other vent on the other side because both the vents on this in this room seem to be hideous dead ends. Which is worrying. Very worrying. Okay, we'll start walking again. We'll start walking again. As long as we can go out and round the room, we should be fine. We should be fine. Um, I don't see any vents for aliens or anything like that. No, none at all anywhere. Uh, I was kind of hoping we'd turn the power off to that floor so we could explore properly. Mm, obviously not the thing that was going to happen today. Obviously not the thing. There is movement behind us. All the way over there. Um, um, I'm going to crawl. I'm going to crawl. I don't like there being movement behind us. I bet it's going to just stay the same distance away from us the entire time, just to really get us. Uh, we're going to carry. We're going to walk if we can. Going to walk if we can, just because you know we've been around here for a while now. So who knows what's going to happen? Uh, the elevator is just down the end there, right? Yeah, do we want to walk across? The, I don't. I, I never want to walk across the middle of a room, especially with a vent like that in the middle of it. That that just seems all sorts of wrong to me. Now I've got a feeling if this was hard difficulty, there'd be an alien walking around at this point trying to cut, grab us. Thankfully, there's not. So we'll just kind of make our way to that elevator over there. That is the elevator we're going for. That is indeed the elevator we're going for. Brilliant, awesome. Let's just let's just walk. Uh, this all appears to be ripped out, but hopefully if we come up here and go, hey, we just want to replace this. Kadonk, kadonk. Alright, awesome. So, who, what do you reckon the compression cylinders are about? This arcane technology that moves things up and down in, in things. And thingy things, right? We're going to the fluid plant. Um, I presume it is a giant organic mechanism that produces fluid. I mean, what else would it be? We appear to be moving up and down. There we go. There, there's the lights to tell us which way we're going. wonder why these lights aren't. Oh, don't you open that door in front of me. Uh, okay, well, I can, I can hear a save point. That is definitely... Exit the synthetic flu fluid plant. Okay, we can do that. We can definitely do that. Let's just get a save, though, because I don't want to do that all over again. Even though I know exactly what, pace, what, what places we're supposed to be going to now. We should probably make it a hell of a lot easier. Right, let's check... The movement sensors, nothing really to work. Why are there lights up there? Um, there appear to be a lot of droids. Or, oh, and you know, synthetics, whatever you call them nowadays. There are a lot of components flying around. It's um, a bit scary. Not sure where we're supposed to be going. I don't even have a marker on our objective thing. But I think as long as we just keep hidden and keep moving, we should get a full map of the area and then figure out exactly what it is we're supposed to be doing. There's a people. Are those acts? I can hear screaming. I think I might just leave them to it. People have had their last chances, and I am not one for even expending my first chance. So uh, let's have a look. Oh look, we're in we're in green rooms now. I wonder why the rooms are green. I don't know. There's an exclamation mark there. I wonder what that was about. Definitely missed something. Oh well. Let's carry on moving. Let's carry on moving. The uh, alternative is to stand here and wait for death, and that's not what I feel like. Not what I feel like at all. Still, 
relatively quiet around here. That's good. I mean, out of the auto, out of all the available options, quiet is a winner. Should we dive in a vent and see where it goes? I think that might be one for us to do. Oh look, this just kind of goes through here, and we can see what's going on the other side. Ah, uh, ah, uh, two people with guns are on the other side of this. She just pointed a gun at me, I'm so I'm gonna like back up and go the other way. I don't think that's what we want to be doing. Oh, I don't think walking in and, and facing someone for death is what we want to be doing. Not a chance. Not a chance. I don't want to die. I just want to make my way around. This is the plant manager's place. Once again, we have a save point possibly indicating that something's about to go on. Does anybody else hear that? It's um, definitely picked up a pace a bit, hasn't it? Should we hide under here? Bust out our movement sensor. No, nothing is moving. That's okay, we can deal with that. Let's read the terminal here. Oh, you know what? I don't want to read this terminal when the music's going on like this. It just it seems like a bad plan, you know. At least if we save it first, then we can come back here immediately afterwards. Ooh, well that, that's my plan anyway. That that is indeed my plan. Yep. Not sure why the music is so hectic. There really doesn't appear to be much going on. There are events everywhere. There are people. Those gunshots or what? I know. Let's check the terminal. Let's check the terminal. That's, that's what we have to do while we're here because there is zero chance of me coming back here without a death. Okay, Seekson, uh, can I get someone from Synthetics to look at my Android? Uh, things are wrong with the Android. I, I'm not even going to go through that. Okay, that's, that's all it is. It's an Android, a faulty Android report. I'm sure there was some hidden bits of information that would have probably given me more information there. Yes, information does indeed give you information. But... I think more importantly is I want to go and find out why the music is so sketchy. Okay, one of them has left. No, they're both still there. I don't know if this is a good plan or a bad plan. We have just saved it, so I'm, I'm going to just kind of wander through on the other side of this table. Okay, there doesn't seem to be anything bad here. What, what am I trying to do? We're on the observation platform. We've, got, we've just got to find the exit. I don't, I don't know where the exit would be. What? Why would it be anywhere near here? Is that... Oh, the reception. Reception's a good way out, right? Okay, so I think what we're going to do... Now, I, do, I know that we're maxed out on flares, so we're going to get the flare out, right? We're going to start it up, and we're going to throw it over that way. And they should both look over there. No? Keep your heads together. You can do it. What's going on here? Why is there no... Okay. The flare was a bad one. Let's try a noisemaker. Okay. And throw it. Very smart. Alright, that's good, right? Now we can just come through here. And walk away, hopefully. No, don't look at me. Don't look at me. There's a noisemaker over there. Okay, brilliant. Wasted two... Well, we wasted one item, used one item. That's, that's alright, because, you know what? We don't really use that many items. Now, is reception the place I want to be? Maybe. Maybe. Who knows? Okay, I'm going to go and hide behind this desk. Maybe the receptionist has a floor plan behind here. Why does the receptionist not have a floor plan? Uh, of all the people... Low power. Dang it. Uh, let's search this place out, see what we can find. Stun baton chart. That is exactly what I'm looking for. Thank you very much. Oh my gosh. That, yes. So much what I was looking for. All right, we're going to put the stun baton back in our hand because it is the best weapon. Uh, do we reload like this? We do. Okay. Right, see? Once I've got the stuff, I know what I'm doing. But it was just how do we use that? Well, a plasma torch required. I don't think we're... I've got a feeling things like the plasma and ion torch, we're never actually going to get. They're just like the other side of the doors that are like we have to access from one specific direction. That's how it's feeling at the moment, anyway. That is how it's feeling at the moment. I, I wouldn't mind that mallet. I'd feel a lot better with that mallet than with the, uh, the maintenance jack. Okay, there is a... another elevator here. Is this our way out? Oh, this is the way. Oh my gosh, yes. Woo, that, that was good. That was real good. I didn't expect us to actually just like sneak our way through like that. 
All right, what we got going next? A motion tracker can be heard if you are very close to an enemy. Use it wisely. Weapons are like tools. You need the right one for the right job. Don't I know it? Don't try and shoot a working Joe. Um, like six bullets to the face, still not enough to take an android down. One stun baton to the face. It's good to keep him busy for a bit. All right, we seem to be stood up again. Let's just roll out. Oh, excuse me. Roll our way out of here. We're looking for a safe point, really. Oh, this candy bar. Eat. Eat me. Oh, no. Meat. It says they do meat bars in the future, do they? Okay. What do we have there? Tomorrow, no together future. Okay. Well, that's some bad English. But I suppose that's supposed to be... Uh, that's supposed to happen in the future, right? English diverges from what we speak nowadays. Uh, is this a device invalid? That's not very good, is it? Uh, where else can we go? Am I going to have to go back because like, I don't have a valid device? What about this one? Use the lever. I am going to use this lever. We're going to hold the right mouse button. We're going to pull it down. And we're going to back up and get away from this. Okay. Looking good. Looking good. Not looking great. Just looking good. It's one of those blood-covered fans again. Wow, I wish these noises weren't quite so loud. Oh, that's why I can't get over there. It's the reception area. Okay, that's fair enough. There is another elevator over there, but I'm not sure where we're supposed to actually go. Look, oh, look, we're here. Okay, we're here. Okay, let's just slowly make our way out. We know, we know where we're going, and we know how we're supposed to get out of here. But we're going to do it quietly. Ever so quietly. We can use the security access tuner. We are good at this now. It only needs... What does it need? Three or four? It needs four this time. Oh, this is... We've been getting getting better at the game, so it's made it harder. That one and that one. There we go. One day I'm going to have so many things to do, I'm going to run out of time. That's, that's going to be bad. Okay, we are looking for Taylor and Samuels. Hello? Hello? No, in fact, we don't, we don't want to make that much noise, do we? Okay, I believe... Yeah, because... What's the exclamation mark? What is the exclamation mark? It's around here somewhere, yeah? Let's go and have a look. Is this it? Supposedly, I'm staring right at it. No, I I see nothing. Does anybody else know what the exclamation mark is about? Let's let's get right. All right. Is it on the other side of the the thing? Maybe it is. Maybe it is. Maybe it's in that um. That's the word I'm looking for. Plasma torch required. Uh, in the reception area that we were looking at earlier. I'm sure we've walked through here already. Why is suddenly like plasma torch required? Things have changed. Maybe. Maybe they've changed. Uh, we are looking the wrong direction, though. Okay, so we're just we're just going to wander down this way. Taking a look out for any vents. You know, like that one. And some... Let's not trigger an alien. That, that would be bad. That would be very bad. Does this door open? This door does not open. Typical. I go the wrong direction. Out of a choice of two, you always get the wrong one. It's much like the uh, the USB, right? Well, you, you've got two options, and it's always the third one that you pick. Okay, let's try and come down this way. What's in this door? <laughs> it's a restore power. That's what's in that door. Uh, so we're going to walk our way down this stairway. Yeah, I'm sure the stair... Oh, oh, it's a blank screen. I sent you a clear directive not to land on station. I told you we didn't hear your message. We understood you would be... Hey. Identify yourself. Ripley. Ripley. From the Torrens. Relax, kid. Yeah, everyone relax. Let's not get ahead of ourselves. Oh, poor Taylor. What the hell is going on here, Marshall? Where's the security forces? Yeah, You're what is going on? At them. Are you weights? I've seen the creature. What is it? I don't know. Something brought here by Marlow, the captain of the Anisadora. The ship that found the flight record. Is there anywhere safe left on this station? That creature's running no. around, and the Seeks and Synthetics are less than friendly. God damn androids. Ripley. Taylor needs attention. Medical's a no-go. We can't take her there. What's the key round her neck about? life support unit back at HQ. Then let's go. Yeah, no, come on, let's go. We gotta save Taylor. We need the transit to get to HQ, but it's down. Transit control is upstairs. Samuels says you're an engineer. Don't yeah. make yourself useful. Seeing as you screwed up the trap. Oh, uh, your weights, yeah, right? We'll talk about that later, weights. You protect them while I'm gone. Understood? What trap? 
Huh? Have I missed something? What what trap are we, have we messed up here? I wish people would give me the full story. But anyway, there is a save point over here, and I'm going to take this opportunity to say thank you very much for joining me for this adventure, guys. I will see you next time when we're going to go save our friend. Because this is what this has been about for, like, five episodes now. We're going to save our friends. Anyway, I'll see you then. We're going to do that. Bye!